As the Christmas season arrives, the air is filled with the scent of cinnamon and the promise of joy. However, it's no secret that Christmas has become synonymous with a massive spending time. In this holiday rush, focusing on buying, it's easy to lose sight of the simple joys that make this season truly special. Christmas, in its essence, has become somewhat hijacked by big corporations turning it into a fest of buying and giving. The tradition of exchanging gifts, while heartwarming, has become a lucrative venture for businesses eager to capitalize on our desire to spread joy. What if, amidst the raping paper and feeling anxious and stressed out cause Christmas is tomorrow and nothing is done, we could find a sense of mindful presence and genuine joy? What if we could reclaim the true spirit of Christmas? Here are some more tips to bring more mindfulness into your Christmas season. During this magical time, take a moment to observe your thoughts surrounding gift giving. Reflect on whether the joy comes from the act of giving, the anticipation of receiving or both. Are you caught up in the pressure of finding the perfect gift? Or can you appreciate the simple thought behind the gesture? Mindfulness invites us to be present in a moment, to savor the joy of giving without the burden of excessive expectations. Consider the value of shared experiences over material possessions. Perhaps a heartfelt conversation, a homemade treat, or a handwritten note can carry more weight than the trendiest gadget that you have to update every month. What about updating our mindful approaches during Christmas? That's where the focus should flow. Crafting thoughtful gifts. This holiday I decided to make pieces of jewelry for my mom and auntie instead of buying them from a store. I wanted to make Christmas more meaningful. Recently I met Agatha and she's so good at making things, especially jewelry, so we decided to create it together. We sat in a comfy room, taking our time and enjoying this peaceful atmosphere. We didn't hurry to make gifts, we just enjoyed the process. While crafting, I felt really focused on the moment and giving it with a purpose. This Christmas, think of gifts that you can make with your own hands. Mindful decorating. Navigating Christmas decoration can be overwhelming. While I love the festive atmosphere they bring, the environmental impact often weighs on my mind. The joy and wonder of the season can sometimes be overshadowed by the thought of excessive waste. Each year, countless Christmas items are produced, contributing to the environmental concerns. How much plastic is enough? How much plastic do we need to feel joy? Never enough. That's why I encourage you to embrace the simplicity of holiday decorations by appreciating what you already have. A few thoughtfully chosen ornaments, candles and lights can work wonders in creating a warm and inviting atmosphere, eliminating the need for extravagant displays. Consider the beauty of using old decorations or giving them a new purpose, infusing them with the new life and meaning. This not only reduces waste, but also adds a personal touch to your festive decor. Embrace the magic of presents. Amidst the twinkling lights and the festive melodies, Remember that the true magic of Christmas lies in being present. Instead of racing through crowded malls, take a leisurely stroll through a winter wonderland. Allow yourself to be captivated by the beauty of the season, the snow, people walking through the park, and the warmth of shared moments. Create mindful traditions that focus on connection rather than consumption. Host a cozy gathering with loved ones where the emphasis is on laughter and togetherness. Share stories, play games and relish the simple pleasure of each other's company. One of the mindful traditions you can also do with others is baking gingerbreads. This timeless tradition isn't just about the delicious end product, but the shared laughter, the sweet aroma and the joy of creating something special together. Once the gingerbread shapes emerge from the oven, the enchanting part begins. Decorating. It's when creativity takes center stage. Each cookie becomes a canvas for artistic expression. Share stories, hopes and dreams as you create tangible expression of love and connection. Yes, gingerbread is an expression of love and connection. I mean, it depends on what story you add to your gingerbread, but this is my story. Tea time. Set aside a quiet corner, perhaps with twinkling lights and a cozy blanket. Brew a pot of your favorite tea. 
Whether it's the comforting warmth of mint or the festive notes of spice chai, the very act of preparing and wanting for the tea to steep becomes a mindful ritual. A moment to slow down and breathe. Inviting warm conversations. Tea time is not just about drinking, it's about the conversation that come alongside. Invite family or friends to join you in this calming interlude. Share stories, cherish memories or simply enjoy the quiet companionship. Try to hear a gentle clinging of the cups as it becomes a melody of happiness, of your family, of all the stories that you are sharing through this beautiful tea time. Embracing gratitude. While Christmas can be a challenging time, especially for those with strained family connection, practicing gratitude remains crucial. Even if communication is tough, making an effort to be grateful is valuable. It's a common misconception that expressing gratitude should immediately awoke pleasant emotions. In reality, emotions might be mixed, but this practice highlights the complexity of experiences and emphasizes the pleasant side of your human experience. You might feel stressed, yet grateful that your family is together. Alternatively, if you are spending the holiday solo, you can be grateful for being present for yourself. Gratitude transcends the circumstances, offering a perspective that there is always some pleasant aspect to acknowledge. What are you grateful for during this Christmas season? Christmas is not just about what's under the tree, but about the love and connection that surrounds us. By embracing mindfulness and simplifying our approach to the holiday season, we can rediscover the joy that truly makes Christmas the most wonderful time of the year. The only wish I have for me and for you is to be as mindful as you can, invite this peaceful energy and try to step aside from this gift rush. Christmas is all about people, smells, coziness and slowing down. Maybe Christmas doesn't come from a store. Maybe Christmas is a little bit more. Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle bells. I teraz jeszcze tak tęsknie zagraj tak wzdłuż.